rest industry super represents uh, 169,000 employers and a lot of those employers come from the franchise sector. By partnering with such reputable associations as the Franchise Council of Australia, we get to meet so many of your great members who are our employers also. Well, one of the greatest benefits of being a partner with the FCA is the fact that we get to meet the key stakeholders for franchise groups where we do a significant amount of business. So being able to talk to them personally, one-on-one, -on -one, and explain to them how we can help their business, it's a really great thing to do. I've been in franchising for 20 years and I actually joined the FCA in my very first year and I guess for an emerging franchisor that was the way to find out all the tricks of the trade. Willingness to share information, ideas and concepts is uh, a great hunting ground for a, an emerging franchisor. It's not just about putting your logo on a, on a brochure or, or exhibiting it at a, at, a, at a convention, it's about being there and helping the, the FCA look after their membership base and provide real value. So for us that's the value, we get to talk to the members of the FCA and help the FCA help their members. Well, the FCA provide a lot of support to the franchising sector uh, and it's important that uh, together that we look to grow franchising throughout Australia and, and inform the general public what franchising is all about. I think there's plenty of benefits of being a member of the FCA. It's the, it's the community, it's the collaboration between franchisors. They give us the opportunity to reach out and speak to people who do what we do, but maybe in slightly different fields. I think uh, the FCA gives a lot of trust to Hudson's Coffee candidates that are putting their uh, name forward. It's a trusted um, uh, alliance with uh, Hudson's Coffee, and I think people get um, a good feeling when they know Hudson's Coffee is a member of the FCA.